Good morning, everybody. Today is January the 9th. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. <laughs> Today is January the 8th, um, 2019. This is a love reading. It's just a general love reading. It does not mean specific to everybody. General. So, if you're interested in your own personal love reading, you have to give me a call at 347-227-5723. So, I'm just picking up on the energies of what's out there for today. So, the energy for love relationships right now is this inner lover's relationship is what i'm seeing is that definitely somebody's in their emotional regard to the things that are going on feeling like they done lost something here the nine of swords somebody's up at night and they're worried about what's going on in their relationship because there's definitely competition you're dealing with somebody and they're dealing with somebody and so on and so forth it doesn't mean you're in your mind you're thinking about this situation not knowing exactly what to do you want to say what you mean and mean what you say because that's what the queen of swords mean and the hermit card said you've been analyzing people placing things and the situation that's going on so what you going to do about it you have the ten of wands here you've been carrying a heavy load for a long time in regard to a lover's relationship and with the nine of cups it talks about this is the wish card. So you're wishing and hoping for something better to come into your life. You know what I mean? You want better. You have the two of wands. You've been waiting for a while. Waiting for a long time. Shit, for that fact, the way he looking. <laughs> and your last card for the love's relationship is you just want your world to change. You're waiting for love to come into your life to make you feel better. That's what I'm saying. Okay, once again, so in a lover's relationship, some of you could definitely be going through it because I see there's a five of cups. The five of cups talk about somebody being in a relationship, feeling as though they've lost something. Normally within a five of cups, there's three cups down and two cups up. So that's over. That doesn't spill. That's nothing you can do with somebody that's just very emotional about that for what they've lost. Up at night, can't see, worrying about a situation. But somebody's getting on somebody's damn nerves. You have the five of ones here. talks about competition. Somebody could be competing for somebody's love here as well. You have the Ace of Swords. This talks about thinking in your mind, thinking about the situation over and over and over. With the Queen of Swords, you want to say what you mean and mean what you say. And with the Hermit card, you're analyzing people, placing things that are in your life as far as love goes. The Ten of Wands talk about you've been carrying a heavy load. You've been carrying a heavy load for a long time. Look at this person. They've been walking and they walk, and it's been a hard road because they're walking on rocks and shit. Look at that. Some heavy load on your back, <clears throat> and you're walking on rock too. So that's too damn much. The nine of cups is saying you're wishing for something better to come into your life, and with the two of wands, it's saying you're waiting, waiting for some love to come into your life. That's what I'm saying. Looking for something better to come, and you want your world to change. All right, you guys, please like, subscribe, comment to my channel. I'm supposed to be a blessing. Have a very blessed day.